Hey everybody, welcome back to the Real Estate Agent Advantage. My name is Lauren Cooper. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you're interested in taking your career in real estate to the next level, you're in the right place. I don't know, that's my new intro, what do you think? Uh, I just wanted to reach out. This is, uh, as you'll see, a very different environment. Uh, I'm in my car, I'm not in the office, and I'm with my daughter, Dylan, say hi. Hi. So here's the deal. Uh, we are in a very, I'd say, ultra competitive industry. And no matter what level you're at, if you're just getting into it, or if you've been in it for years and you've reached a, a really high level of success, it's very difficult at times. It can be very, very stressful. And it's a lot to put on your shoulders, you know, as a business person, as an entrepreneur, and as a salesperson. Um, you know, there are always ups and downs that you have to deal with. Now, the reason why I'm talking about that is we, Dylan and I, uh, we went to see a movie today. They they were uh, staying home from school. There was a weather warning, which didn't actually happen, but they canceled school anyway. Don't ask. And um, I decided, you know what? I've been having a terrible string of just garbage, you know, and, and I'll always be honest with you guys. And I'm being honest now, like it's just been a string of crap <laughs> uh, dealing with certain uh, people that have not been great situations that have not worked out. Um, over the last couple of weeks, it's just been very, very frustrating and very stressful. And it's gotten to the point where I, it, it really basically got to me. Now, in this industry, we have to build up a thick skin. We, you know, one little rejection, this, that, that's not what I'm talking about. But after a while, it can build, especially if you don't take time for yourself to recharge. And I've noticed lately that I've just been supremely stressed out and um, not really able to bring my best to the table. So I decided, you know what, kids are home today. I am going to take the day off. I'm not going to work, even though I did a little bit. <laughs> um, I'm not going to work uh, a lot because, you know, as real estate agents, uh, people in the industry, we can get lost in the grind or the hustle. And that's really glorified these days, you know, like 24 seven grind and hustle, but that'll wear you down. And that's basically where I found myself uh, over the last couple of weeks and specifically today. So I decided, forget it. Uh, I'm going to take Dylan to see Batman, right? What'd you think? It was a really good movie. Yeah, I, I, this is my second time seeing it. Uh, as you can see, I'm a comic book fan. Um, I didn't, I had a lot of problems with it the first time. I liked it better the second time. Still have a lot of problems. Colin Farrell was amazing, but <laughs> this isn't a Batman review. This is just the, the fact that sometimes you need to take time for yourself to recharge. Now, I'm not talking about being lazy. I'm not, and, and here's the thing, you know, there's a certain level of guilt associated with taking time off sometimes because we work for ourselves. And if we're not working, we're not making anything. You know, we're not on that salary. But you have to know and recognize in yourself the time that you need to take for yourself to recharge, to bring the best to the table, to get the best results um, for you and your family. And this is what I needed today. Uh, I just wanted, it's an important message to share with everybody. So I wanted to throw that out there, recognize those times. I mean, it's important on a, you know, a regular basis to take a day off a week, you know, in this industry, it can feel really difficult. And for me specifically, I've had situations in the past where I've taken, you know, time off and I've lost out on deals and maybe that's made me paranoid. <laughs> um, but it's important for your own mental and physical and emotional well-being. You need to take time off. So I know a friend of mine in the industry, he, he decides, you know, one day a week, no business at all. It's just him and his family. I'm working towards that. I can't really get myself to that point <laughs> yet. Uh, and that's all in my own head. And that's something that I need to work on. Uh, we all have things that we need to work on. But I'm basically working all the time. And even on days where, you know, I don't have appointments, I've still got things on my mind, marketing projects, all these other things that I'm working on. I mean, Dylan will tell you that I'm working pretty much every single day, right? Yeah. yeah and that can be difficult. I mean, is that difficult for, for you to see me working all the time and not spend time with me? Mm-hmm. So, I mean, it, listen, family is important and I, I have to take, we have to take time for our family. So... I wanted to reach out on a more personal level, let you guys know that it's normal, it's okay to be stressed out and to feel these these frustrations. But when they get to a certain level and you feel like you know it's just too much, step away. 
don't feel guilty. It's all right. For me, we decided to go and see a movie. Um, you know, just get yourself out of it, whatever it is for you, for a couple of hours or for a day and get back to it tomorrow because that's what I'm going to do. This definitely helped me. Thank you for hanging out with me, sweetie. And, uh, and yeah, I just wanted to send that message out to everybody else. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the next video. I'll see you guys on that. Take care. Bye. Say bye, Dylan. Bye.